Good morning everybody. So today Big Daddy is going to install a new thermostat. We put this one in sometime last year. Um, but it's it's not super accurate. I mean, I want it set on 72. Sometimes it blows and blows and it's like 68 in here. Sometimes it doesn't kick on until it gets to like 74. So we purchased one of these digital ones and Big Daddy is going to attempt to wire it up. I've researched online um, how to wire it. so. Hopefully we don't break the air conditioner and we will show you how we do it. This one actually came from Ace. Ace is the place. Helpful Hover Man. So this is the one we got. We had purchased one from Home Depot, but unfortunately we got it all wired up and it wouldn't work. But it wasn't the wiring, the thermostat itself wouldn't work so I already put the batteries in this one and it does work so the other one didn't work with the batteries so it was definitely the thermostat so that one would be going back. So the first thing Big Daddy did is take a picture of the wiring that's currently up there. Last time all we had to do is uh, put the new or put the wires back in the same place because we used the same thermostat that was broken. This time we have to wire it differently, so we need to know what's what. Now he's undoing the existing wires. Next, removing the plate of the old thermostat. Okay, next Big Daddy is taping off the red, because apparently that is not used. Uh, in the digital thermostat and we're also going to tape off the blue at this time because we're a little unsure of the toggle. The blue is the high fan so we're just going to have low fan right now which is all we really use. I mean we very seldom turn it on high fan but we do have the toggle switch uh, after we talk to our electrician. All right, now Big Daddy's wiring up the new diagram which I got off the line. So we're doing brown to G, white to W, yellow to Y, and green to RH, leaving the RHRC jumpers alone. Now I would like to say they're not all the same. There are so many different variations of wire colors and thermostats. So please don't use our direction and research your RV compared to your thermostat. No, oh, actually, they're all supposed to be the same. Not the ones I've seen online. They use different colors. Well, I'm just saying they're supposed to. Oh, <laughs> but guys, promise they're not. The air just kicked on. Is it, is it blowing? Though? No, no blowing. So the toggle didn't work because the, well, the fan wasn't blowing. So going back to the original plan, <laughs> which was to hook it up without the toggle switch. So that's what we're doing now. And that means Big Daddy just capped off the blue and we're using the brown wire only, which is low fan. We have it hanging off now because at first when we turned it on, we uh, had it in auto and the air was running like the compressor but not the fan. It worked when we had it in the on position. So it's been running now for about I don't know, half an hour and we turned it into auto and it's still running the fan. So we've got it set to 72. So we're going to wait for two more degrees and see if the fan shuts off with the air conditioner. All right, so the fan kicked off with the air conditioner so the auto is working so Big Daddy is going to put the thermostat back up properly on the wall. Well done Big Daddy. Alrighty, couldn't have done it without you Bubbles. 
<laughs> so we do thank you today for joining us for the updated thermostat and we'll be back soon with more videos. Y'all have a great day. Bye.